Hello, happy Sunday. This is 12 Faces of Sober. Um, first and foremost, I would like to send a big, 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 big thank you to those who pre-ordered the books prior to uh, Wednesday when I got the um, my first batch of books. I really, uh, I really appreciate you guys being patient. You know, I won't call out none of my friends. It wasn't no family members, but it was some friends in San Diego that was like, where is my book? And and it's understandable. You guys paid for it. But like I said, the book is on its way. I, I mailed them off Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Uh, so you guys should um, actually have them uh, Monday, Tuesday or Wednesday at the latest Thursday. Uh, I sent it. Uh, like I said, it depends on the post office. Uh, you, you can thank your president and the joy for any mishaps with the post office. Um, but like I said, 12 Faces of Sober is me. 12 Faces of Sober is is a, a, a fraction of my life. It's a fraction because I'm going to branch off and write a couple more books geared towards certain portions of the book. Um, and like I said, this book is, is, is to help it. The, the book is there to, to kind of put you in a situation. If you're in an abusive relationship, male or female, um, it, it gives you the perspective of somebody who was going through some very tough times. Like I said, I, I dealt with abortions. I dealt with miscarriages. I dealt with infidelity in relationships. I dealt with um, domestic violence being on the receiving end. Um, these are the things that I don't have a problem with talking with, you know, talking about. You know, some people have told me like, wow, man, it takes a lot to put it on paper. I agree because I never really and truly thought that I would write a book, even though I mentioned in the book that back in uh, I think it was 2002, I wanted to write a book. But I was young and didn't didn't know <laughs> what I was getting myself into. And the title was crazy. So I might write that book, too. It's called Playing the Game. But anyway, um, I really do appreciate it. You know, I've, I've gotten good response from it. Um, I've gotten questions about the book, which is understandable because not everybody's going to be happy because they, they might be in it and, you know, might get talked about. But it's not to, to def, you know, you know defame somebody's name or anything like that it's just my perspective if people aren't happy with my perspective you could do exactly what i did you could sit down and write a book it's not not taking no shots but it's the honest to goodness truth you know what i mean i'm not a perfect author but by the time i get to be a perfect author at least you guys can say well i did get his first book or first books and there's an improvement because it's going to be there's always room for improvement um i also want to send a big shout out to uh manny brazilia if i pronounce your name wrong manny i'm sorry bro but he's the one who designed the dope uh the dope uh cover the bad part about it is the cover on the back uh i couldn't get the title but it's all good and and, and don't worry manny you're going to be taken care of very well also, my editors, uh, Patricia Ogilvy and my sister, Laquisha Oliver, I really do appreciate it. Uh, to my dude, Chas Bridgewater, uh, he's been uh, a, a sounding board as far as advice and how to, you know, do things in the game. Like I said, a lot of this I did, you know, in terms of, you know, finances, you know, I had to figure out a way to how to how to get this stuff done. But it got done. And I, I appreciate those who helped me out financially because it was it was some tough times where it it wasn't easy to come out with, you know, some of these fees. But I appreciate it. And um, like I said, I'm going to, you know, single out a few groups of people. If you are a veteran or active duty military personnel, this is a book that. I believe that you guys need to read. And the reason being is because it, it gives you a perspective of what goes on in the, the military and the, the BS that you have to put up with superior 
especially superior that's younger, and they try to use that to their advantage. And then they try to exploit the fact that if you have a problem with addiction, because that's what they did in, uh, in my career. And that's what turned me off and got me out the army. But like I said, those that are deployed, this might be something to help you out, especially knowing that you can't drink. Um, also, to those that are locked down, I know a few people that are locked down. You know somebody that's locked down and they like literature? Go ahead and get that for them. Also, you guys can donate. You can donate, you know, buy a book, send it to the USO or send it to, to an AA group or anything. Wh whatever you need to do. All I'm asking for is the support. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, the books are, are doing rather well. They're, they're doing rather well. Uh, I don't know if I showed this in the video, but I'm going to do it again. Yeah. I still got some available. This is the this is my second order. No joke. Um, and I hope by by the end of the week. Uh, I'll be out of these ones too. Um, like I said, there's a lot of people who said that they were going to buy the book. Now is the time. So make sure you grab it. There's a lot of people liking the video, but not purchasing. So go ahead and do that as well. Um, like I said, 12facesofsober.com. I'm going to be adding some merchandise, probably some hoodies in the next two or three days. Um, you're going to see more blogs from me. You're going to see more videos. And like I said, share, share the book. It, it, it don't matter you could say something good about me or you don't have to, but just share, share, share. Because there's a lot of people that know me that's on my friends list. These are not just random people that I'm adding. So show love, show support. I greatly appreciate it. Enjoy your Sunday. Be blessed. And the Chargers are going to upset the Saints tomorrow. Mark my words.